What's up guys? Welcome to season 2, episode 1 of Football Love. It's been a while, but we are back. So I'm Amsha. And I'm Bill. And this is Football Love. Five minutes later. Fifteen minutes later. Well, I'm just still not here. Guess that means I need to find a new host for Football Love. Would you like to be the host of football now? Would you like to be the host of football now? Football now? Football? Yeah. Why not? Looks like we have a new host of football now. I'm gonna make you guys proud. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so actually you know, we have a new host for Footballer. So Mick, would you like to introduce yourself? Hi everybody, all the fans of Footballer, my name is Mikkel. Some of you might have already known me, I'm a fan of Home United. We're gonna win the league, we're gonna win the league. Sorry, we're gonna be a bit neutral right now. So. Uh, Footballer is still gonna go on, it's still gonna be fun. We're very proud to have Mikkel on board. Mikkel will be with us until Amsha finishes his phone call. I don't know when that will be. It's been a while. So, let's hang around and see what happens. So for this episode, we're going to look towards the future of Singapore football. So Bill has caught up with a student from Guangyang Secondary School football team. And he seems to be a promising young talent. Let's yep. go check it out. Let's go! Yeah, oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's go! Hey, come back! Alright, so we are here at the National Stadium, a place that's really beautiful and that is supposed to be the future of football. And in this week where we talked about SPL and rebranding and looking for the future, we have with us a very bright talent for our future. So, what's your name? My name is Muhammad Darren Teo and I'm from Banya Secondary School. Mm -hmm. So what made you interested in football? Yes, growing up, my father was a, a soccer player. and. When my father asked me to join soccer, but I still don't know. I didn't know what to do. And after that, like, I finally decided to play soccer. Then I started looking at players in Singapore, so that I can motivate myself to be better than them or be like them. I look up to Safan Barudin a lot. Okay, Safan Barudin. So you're seeing the lines out there today, so we are filming this live in the in the Singapore versus Maldives match. So looking at the lines out there, how do you feel right now? The by the score is one one, just after half time. They are doing good, good right now, but I think they shouldn't have played at the back too much because like, they are getting pressure too much. What position do you use to play in your school? Uh, center midfield. Center midfield, okay. Do you think if you were to play one day for the Lions, you can be a talent? Maybe, I guess. Would you, not, would you like to play for the national team one day? Definitely, of course. I think everybody who plays soccer, I think just their team represents Singapore. What's your aspirations for your school this year? We are in the top 16 right now, but right now our group stage is like one of the best team in the in whole Singapore, like Jerongville and Queensway, like they are like the toughest, toughest team I've ever met. And how, how do you like your coach? Yeah, I mean he's great, right? he motivates us every day to train, to do our fitness and everything. Yeah. Look out during the school championship on the outside, it's going to be a uh, force to reckon with. So. With that, I'd like to introduce to you a star in our future, Darren That's it from us for today and 
We're going to come back with another episode very soon, but before that, we will be going to the community show happening next week. So, yes. would you like to tell the community? So the community show, which is the first game of the new Singapore Premier League, will start on the 31st of March, which is next Saturday in the National Stadium. So, please get your tickets and see you guys there. See you! Bye-bye! No, no, no. Is it, is it called the, the community show or charity show, man? It's, it's so confusing. Yeah, then so tomorrow, yeah. Uh,